Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. If your Airno eSIM isn't activating, don't worry. We are here to help. In this video, we will go through some easy troubleshooting steps to get your eSIM up and running in no time. Let's jump right in. Why Airno eSIM not activated? Insufficient coverage. The eSIM requires a stable connection within a supported coverage area. If you are in a location without coverage, activation may fail. APN settings not updated. If the access point name settings are not configured correctly, the eSIM may not function properly. Too many eSIM profiles. Devices have a limit on the number of eSIM profiles they can store. If this limit is reached, the new SIM may not activate. Network selection issues. Automatic network selection may not connect to the correct network. Manually selecting a network can sometimes resolve activation problems. Check Carrier Unlock Status For iPhone, go to Settings, then General, then go to About, scroll down and look for Carrier Unlock. If it says SIM Lock, your iPhone is locked to a specific carrier. For Android, go to Settings, then Network and Internet, then go to SIMs. Choose the SIM card you want to configure for dual SIM phones. Turn on the Automatically Select Network option. If it is unlocked, you have to contact respective service provider or mobile brand. Check Device Compatibility eSIM support may vary by region and carrier. Always check with your carrier to confirm if your specific device model supports eSIM. For devices with hybrid SIM tray, using the eSIM may require disabling one of the physical SIM slot to enable dual SIM functionality. Make sure your device is eSIM compatible. Go to Airlow device support page. I have provided the link in the description. You can directly go through it and check with the available phone list. Out of coverage range. Check if you are within the coverage area for the eSIM you purchased. If you are outside the coverage zone, the eSIM will not work. Go to Airlow. I have provided the link in the description. You can directly go through it. Then look for the eSIMs link in the navigation menu and click on it. Choose the country or region you plan to visit from the list of available eSIMs. On the eSIM page, you will find information about the coverage in your selected destination. This includes the supported networks and the countries covered by the eSIM. Restart your device. You can also restart your device if your top-up is not reflected in your network. For iPhone, press and hold the side button and either the volume up or volume down button until the slider appears. Drag the slider to turn off your iPhone. After it turns off, press and hold the side button again until you see the Apple logo. For Android, press and hold the power button until the power menu appears. Select Restart or Reboot. Fix 5. Remove other eSIM profiles. If your device has reached its limit of eSIM profiles, remove any unused eSIMs to make space for the ALO eSIM. For example, the iPhone 13 and iPhone 14 models can have two active eSIMs at the same time. Other iPhone models such as the iPhone XS, XS Max, XR and earlier can only support one active eSIM alongside one physical SIM. Hence, users of older models are limited to one eSIM and one physical SIM, restricting their ability to manage multiple lines without a physical SIM card. For iOS Open Settings, select Cellular, choose the Unused eSIM under the SIM section. Scroll down and tap on Delete SIM then confirm deletion. For Android, open settings, tap on network and internet, SIM or mobile network, choose the eSIM, delete the eSIM. For Google Pixel, scroll down and tap on Erase SIM, then confirm by tapping Erase SIM again. For Samsung Galaxy, tap on Remove and verify using your biometrics or lock screen password, then confirm the removal. For OnePlus, tap on the three vertical dot next to the eSIM and select Delete, then confirm the deletion. Check APN settings. Update the access point name settings if necessary. Sometimes the APN need to be manually configured for the eSIM to function properly. This required APN settings are usually provided upon activation. You may not enable the data access to Airlo SIM. Step 1. Find APN. Open Airlo app and click Direct tab. Scroll down to Access Data. Click copy-paste icon or note down the APN name. For iOS, go to settings then cellular or settings or go to mobile. Click cellular data network to go to APN settings. Enter global data as APN name. Leave remaining field as it is. 
For Android, open settings, go to connection or mobile networks, select ALO eSIM, access point name, click on plus sign or add APN, enter following. Name, APN, APN Global Data, leave remaining fields as it is, click 3 dot at top right and then click save. Check your designation. Ensure that you have physically arrived at the destination for which the top-up was purchased. Airlow top-ups are location-specified and will only activate once you are in the designated area. Manually select Network. If iMessage is still not working, try manually selecting the network for your Airlow eSIM. Go to Settings, then Cellular, select your Airlow eSIM. Tap on Network Selection, then turn Automatic Off. Select the appropriate carrier network. You can see your local network name in your plan under Network. Reinstall the eSIM. If the eSIM remains inactivated, consider removing it and reinstalling it using a new QR code from Airlo. Log in to your Airlo account. Go to My eSIMs. Choose the eSIM you want to install, then click on Details button. Click Install eSIM or Access Data and select QR code. Save the code to your phone or take a screenshot or print out. For Android, open Settings, go to Connections, SIM Manager, then add eSIM. Open Saved QR code from your Airlo. Click Scan QR code from the service provider. Scan the QR code directly. Click on Add to install eSIM. Once the eSIM is installed, you will be brought to the Settings page. Scroll down and click SIM Manager, then go to Mobile Data. Select the eSIM you installed. For Google Pixel, go to Settings, click on Network and Internet, click the plus icon next to SIMs and click Download eSIM instead. Click Next and scan QR code using Camera. Click Download button. Once downloaded is successful, go to Settings page. Click eSIM and click Airlo eSIM. Now turn on Use SIM, Mobile Data and Roaming. For iPhone, go to Settings, then go to Cellular or Mobile, click Add eSIM. Click Use QR Code and click Open Photos. Select the saved QR code from device. Click Continue. Again, click Continue button to active the SIM. Click Done and add a cellular or mobile plan label to the newly installed eSIM. Then click Secondary, enter Air Low or your preferred label. Click on Done and tap Continue. Choose your primary line for calls and text messages and click Continue. Select your primary line for iMessage and FaceTime and click on Continue to activate the SIM. Choose your Airlo eSIM for cellular or mobile data. Turn off Allow Cellular Data Switching if it is enabled. Click on Continue. Now eSIM has been installed and activated. Technical Support If package is yet to activate, Contacting ALO's customer support may be necessary. They can provide specific guidance based on your situation. Go to ALO support page. I have provided the link in the description. You can directly go through it. Then click on send us a message to connect with ALO support. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more videos, hit the subscribe button.